Um, I'm gonna be filming a room tour, guys. So I have my desk over here, so beautiful. And I have some stuff here, I have my bed here. I have like everything in here, like so much aesthetic things. Can you guys believe it? I have my dream room. Hello, my fellow artists, or should I say, hello, my fellow travelers, because today I am moving and I will bring you along with me. So enjoy traveling. So, as you guys know, I did not post last Friday, but I did post a short saying that I will post something exciting, and here we are. I officially moved August 1st, and you guys are seeing this a bit later because obviously August 1st is not Friday. In the clip you're seeing right now, I'm watching people get in the plane because I'm really bored and I have nothing to do because our plane was delayed on 20 minutes because it was way too late, which caused chaos later. And when I say chaos, I mean like chaos, like it was dumb, like chaotic. We flew on a Air Canada plane. I think it was like a Bombardier. I don't know. They have like French names for some reason or something. I don't know. So it was pretty like good because, you know, Air Canada planes are pretty good. And basically the planes were both small but because that's an average plane. I had the seat that like was right beside the wing. So, you know, perfect footage be like. And if you see the footage being blurry, it's because they don't clean their windows. I've looks like they the last time that they cleaned that window was like in 1885 and you will see a lot of footage of just the wing and me flying because well that's kind of you know moving and i didn't want to you know yank my phone out of my backpack and like take my backpack and like take stuff out to get my phone out when it was like the rush that we had to run which i'll explain later like no i'm just gonna explain it to you instead of showing it to you because i didn't film that part because it was chaotic and here is us taking off um yeah it's not too special i mean just plain taking off the feeling though like the like the last time i went on a plane i was six when i moved to canada so i didn't get that feeling in a while and it was like very like interesting and my ears did not hurt only on the second plane at the like the last 10 minutes so lisa how did you move Here's the story. Obviously, the start was putting everything in boxes. Our family friends picked me, my mom, and my brother up and drove us to their house. Well, my dad was in our car bringing some stuff over. Obviously, me and my friend had a lot of fun and had sleepovers, went to a water park, literally had so much fun together for the last four days together. The day after, my dad left to drive to our place because he had the car and he drove with half of our boxes. And then four short days later, we drove at about 4 p.m. to the airport. Since we checked in the night before um, online, all we had to do was go through security. And two hours later, we finally got on our first plane. My one-year-old brother was sleeping. And here's a trace picture of me and my mom. Once we stopped flying, we went up to the flight attendant and asked this question, are we supposed to get off? Isn't this a plane directly to our location? And the flight attendant literally went, nah, this plane isn't going there. It's going to the place that we literally started from. Take into consideration, that was a one-way plane and we shouldn't have taken another plane. Just because our plane was late, we had to switch completely different planes and me and my mom ran. And then another flight attendant went, hurry up, section A, slot 18, go. And then me and my mom ran again for eight straight minutes and actually finally got on our second, which wasn't even supposed to happen, plane was supposed to be 40 minutes but took two hours later because of some person that was late for their plane and they had to wait an extra 40 minutes because of those people and let me tell you something the reason me and my mom were late is because our first plane was late so they had to wait while our first plane was still flying because it was 20 minutes late so they had to wait ext extra 20 minutes so technically everyone in the plane waited another extra hour and then we had to wait for all the instructions going on over and over again in French and English and Spanish and whatever. Yeah, this is why I hate switching planes. As I've said, two hours later, at 9.30 p.m. we finally drove home, which I'll tell you, was 11.30 in where I used to live. So I was exhausted. And I mean exhausted from running all that chaos. I swear, I do not want to fly and move again. 
So moral of the story, that's what happened. And this is plane two setting off. And the next couple clips is just gonna be how we flew and just real footage because I didn't want to just leave that out because you know, it's really good footage and the sunset is beautiful. So yeah, and I will put a speed paint on the side that will be posted in a shorts before this video even posts. So if you haven't seen that shorts, it's gonna be right here. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and you can watch the little speed paint that's probably getting over by now. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and bye-bye. See you next week.